going to get to radar 2 because it costs 2 points, right? Or does it... wait, where does it tell me? No, it only costs 1. Okay, if I get radar 2, I get double radar range. It seems pretty good, obviously. obviously. Social enhancer. Sounds good. I've already got both info links. And stealth enhancer, you're, you're right, I can't get because it costs two. I can upgrade hacking. Yes. I can get turret domination. What do you think? There's three options I can get here. Try and free the hostage, fight, let's his face or let him go. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try fighting him because I'm gonna do. That's fun. I can't quick save yet, but I quick saved just like a few seconds earlier, so... You know what, we're gonna try and fight him. If you don't shoot him fast, well, you'll see. It's not really a fight. I messed it up. I gotta load. Uh huh. I was just like, they put me like one inch too far out of the, you know, zap gun range, zap zap. I gotta move like one step forward and shoot. What the heck? I wonder if I can skip the cutscene this time around. I hope so, because that was a pretty long cutscene. Oh crap, my quick save was right before she died. Oh my god. I gotta do this like really fast the second it loads. Oh, I can get move and throw heavier objects for one point. That's so tempting. I know, I imagine it is. Also carrying capacity. Come on, come on, load, 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 load. Also see through walls. I did it! I won! Awesome. Yeah, I can't afford reflex booster. SWAT couldn't save the hostages, I guess I lost? You didn't save the hostages, bro. Did, you didn't even find them, did you? No, I didn't. Yeah, you had to find them. Well, in the next playthrough. Nope, time to load. Fuck that. Actually, no, I can't even do that. Well, if you have a... if do you have an autosave from before the fight? Then yeah, I do. Then you can backtrack. That'll take forever. I'm just gonna keep going. Your choice. Yeah, I know. Man, it also costs two just to be able to buy this stuff. Cloaking costs two. I couldn't save the hostages, that feels pretty bad, because this game isn't linear, so I didn't look for him actively. This level is linear, but, I mean, it's not, like, 100% linear, you can miss stuff. I yeah, mean, I can. It's basically the extended tutorial, but it's not going to handhold you that much, like, they don't go on the radi radio, Hey, bro, you need to find the hostage room, bro. Here's a point. Here's the mark on your waypoint, bro. They don't do that. I don't know. I think I might buy turret domination. I mean, there's a turret here, right? I can just pick it up and kill everyone. Maybe next playthrough.
Some of the obstacles that can be circumvented by hacking include turrets, cameras, and robots. All you need to do is find a security hub. Well, next playthrough, I'll try for the hostages. Okay. This time, I will just have to say sorry. And Fortify programs are your main yeah. hacking tools. You can upgrade their ratings via hacking augmentations. A node's rating affects the speed at which the network can process it. Therefore, higher rated nodes will slow the network down. You can slow it down further by fortifying nodes, which will increase their effective rating. You can also use a slow worm to stop the trace process entirely for a few seconds. Finally, to prevent detection when taking over nodes, you can use the Nuke virus, which gives you a 0% detection chance. The Nuke and Stop programs are expendable viruses. Their supplies are limited, so use them wisely. A counter in the top right corner of the screen helps you keep track of them. When hacking, there are three types of nodes to capture. Directories are meaningless data holders. They serve no purpose other than to allow you to travel to your destination. APIs are system functions that can be used against the network. They can slow it down by spamming it, or they can lower node ratings to make them easier for you to capture. Data APIs, stores contain yeah. valuable information that can result in money, programs, or you even experience. You should look uh, for the hostages that make sure you do. The system will only be yours I don't know exactly where they are, so sorry, can't help Otherwise, with that one. Rewards cannot be downloaded and will remain That's on the system. Suspended. Aside from cameras and doors, you will not be able to shut down any security device until you get the right augmentation upgrade. Okay, if a turret saw me, does that count against my stealth ratings? Yeah, it does. Crap. I gotta figure out a way around, look for a vent or something. Events the game. Hooray. Okay, so the turret is really heavy. Yeah, there's a vent to get around it. But if I upgraded my Praxis, I could move it and carry it around. Hmm. Tempting, right? Oh, let's just go talk to the hacker. I'm hacking, bro. I am bad CG. In this part of the game, again. Step away from the console. The now! The CG looks so much worse than the trailer. Yeah, it really does. Like, just use the trailer CG for this part of the game. I have a feeling that in that first room with three people, when they shot someone, if you had gone right instead of straight, you would have gone to the hostages. Son of a bitch! Because I never got to see the hostages. 
If you just keep going straight and keep trying to get around, like from A to B, you're gonna miss the hostages. Patch me to Seraph now. You can also go back. Yeah, I kind of imagine you can traverse the elevators again, but I never tried. Adam, it's David. You got the typhoon? Yeah, but you were right about there being something more behind this. Because I've also got a dead purist in here with some pretty interesting cerebral implants. Don't touch him. We'll need an expert to recover his neural hub, in case it's booby-trapped. Copy that. What about Sanders? SWAT's pressure me to let them off the leash. Find them before they do, and deal with them. Oh, this is hilarious. He's like, don't touch the hacker who's dead, and I'm like, I'll just drag his body around. It don't matter. I like how if you turn the TVs off, they reset the program that's on. Okay, I did the hacker thing, now what are they? Uh -huh. I don't know where the hostages are, I can't tell you. Just go where you think you need to. Elevator, let's go back up. Heading to the head office. It's hilarious, you can watch the police fight the Purists. Mm, purists don't do too well. Okay, yeah, I'm near the end already. This is the head office part. I gotta go back. Uh, backtracking. At least it's doable. Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully, it, you know, taking too long didn't get the hostages killed. Yeah, I'm not sure it does as long as it, once you're in the mission. I'm not clear on that point, though. How far in are you? How convenient of them to build these vents that circumvent tur turrets. Yeah, that's nice. Okay, going back up the elevators. The guy heard me sneaking up on him. I should remember to crouch. Always crouch walk. Adam Jensen. Since this is, I'm playing through a what if scenario right here, I'm gonna save, make a big, like a real save. Well, I mean, that's the point of these games, right? And then I'm gonna load the autosave and make a save, and then I'm gonna go back through guns blazing and see if I can get to the hostages. Just for fun. Okay. 
I might actually just be like, fuck it, and go through that game depending on the outcome. I might 